Hello, welcome to Deja Vu Tarot. I'm back with another collective read, guys. Once again, this is a collection of energies. We have Pisces, Air, Virgo, Scorpio, and Fire. So you can have any one of these signs on the board. <sighs> Pisces, I'm sorry, guys. I just did a whole recording. I thought I had was recording it. So, once again, click on all the links in the description box below, guys. Um, I have way more content. Welcome newcomers. Hit the like, subscribe button. And I have sexual tarot reads, so definitely check out all my content. Pisces, you could be thinking about a Virgo here or a Virgo. You could be thinking about someone else a lot. And this Pisces is very jealous. This Pisces and Scorpio, they are angry with the fire sign on the board. Or this could be a young fire sign. Scorpio and Pisces who's working on you Virgo y'all can have any of this on your chart somebody is definitely playing with your mental here they are in they using black magic but of course it's not working okay all right they are they know you're sad without your person okay they could be sad without you you could have cut these people out your life and now they're trying to throw some type of psyche magic in your mind so you can continue to think about them. Pisces, you don't want no love. You or your person, you just want sex from this person. So, of course, you're doing spell work on this person business. You're, you're trying to hate. This could be on a divine feminine business or divine masculine. Okay, this person don't love you. This Pisces, they just want sex and you, because you're not giving them no sex. They are sad, okay? And they doing black magic on your business, but it ain't working, okay? They're sad because you don't love them, Virgo, okay? So that's what's going on at this time. So they're doing it on your business. They don't want your business to fluctuate. So just return it back to sender, guys. Return it back. And green is here, so they could be trying to not have you have any type of money you could be aquarius Libra, gemini this pisces is doing spell work on your business they just want sex they don't love you okay now pisces you could be getting sick from the magic because it's returning back and you constantly keep doing it and it's going on your skull spirit say you need to love yourself okay you need to love yourself also scorpio you need to love yourself air sign you need to love yourself so this is definitely a gang of people who clearly do not love themselves and you guys need to work on your affirmations okay pisces you could just be getting pill high with your karmics with your friends divine feminine masculine one of y'all are getting pill high okay and spirit is saying love yourself you're taking pills and doing magic so you could be doing it with an aries leo sagittarius okay Spirit is saying this person will let go of control. So that's why y'all angry because this person let go of control. And now they they loving themselves and y'all are mad about it. Uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So you and a Pisces could be doing it on a Libra, Aquarius, Gemini here and a Scorpio. This Virgo don't know about it. They could You could be lying to this Virgo because I feel like this Virgo energy is kind of... No, they do know about it. They do know about it. They're sad too. Okay. Spirit say y'all need to pursue y'all dreams. And don't worry, chosen ones. Okay, people that they, they throwing this on. They don't got no control, Spirit say. It's not working. Okay. So continue to pursue y'all dreams. Pisces, you could be doing this to an air sign. Okay. Love is this person don't love them so that's why they doing it but it ain't working all right so this came out over virgo this is my lyrical miracle deck it say you don't know my name by alicia keys but it came out in reverse so that's why i said they know virgo do know and it say didn't you know by erica badu but it came out in reverse so virgo you know everything about it you probably not saying anything okay and you're sad that it's going on, but you need to speak up if you do know something is going on and they doing this to an air sign. All right. We had Anaconda come out by Nicki Minaj. He say, by the way, what he say, he could tell I ain't missing no meals. This flipped out over Scorpio. So Scorpio, you 
could have an anaconda or you want the masculine because he got an anaconda. I'm not for sure. This Scorpio lying awake at night thinking about your anaconda, divine masculine. And the truth hurts because they know they're not the 100% bitch. They're not the real bitch. They fake. Fake, fake, fake. And they know that you know they're not real. So they lie on that way at night. Now, you could have cut these people off. This Scorpio lie awake at night thinking about you. They can't sleep. They want you to call them. So they could be messing with your psyche here, wanting you to call them. Okay. Spirit said they need to let go and let God. Because they playing with your psyche. They playing mind games. They doing black magic. They in your skull. Trying to get you to call them because they want some, some penis. That's just the truth. They want your un anaconda. They act like they fiending. They can't take it. They act like they ain't never had none before. I'm just get, keeping it real. Spirit say they just a narc. Okay, they narcissists. If you cut the, the supply off, they are crazy. So Spirit is saying set healthy boundaries and these people don't got none. So you got to set them. Yeah. You got true love. You need to set healthy boundaries, divine feminine, divine masculine, whoever this is. Okay. This person is a karmic feminine. She thinks you're the true love. She's delusional. She is. She's dreaming about you at night. She's thinking about the anaconda. Okay. She thinks she's the hundred percent true love. And she ain't. She an art. Spirits say, set healthy boundaries. This person got a side dude, okay, a side chick she messing with, but yet she studies saying affirmations, trying to work with this Pisces here to put a, a bad juju on your business. Could be with a side dude that she working with. We got another karmic male that's selfish here, okay, female, whichever. We got feminine. This air, this... Fire sign is a feminine. 717 as I say that. This Scorpio could be a jealous karmic male or dude that they're working with here. This dude could be the Pisces. I'm not for sure. It's like a gang of them. I feel like the Pisces could be the dude. The, the fire sign is a woman, a karmic feminine. This Scorpio... Is a feminine, but she working with a dude too. This dude could be a feminine. I don't know. They could be transgender. And they working, they all working together trying to end your business. And they think it's some type of true love. They working with a satanic cult. This Aries could be a ringleader in this satanic cult. She could be the one, or he could be the one that's leading this whole operation. This the one that does the affirmations. Each one of them got a part to play. She could be doing confusion spells on you. The Pisces is the one that is doing it on your business. The Scorpio is the one that is in your psyche trying to get you to call them. They're thinking about you all night. They want some sex. Or they could be having a penis and they want some or whatever. It could be in first name, middle initial, last name, who is the Scorpio. This person going to jail. Or they could be in a spiritual mind prison. That's why they're thinking round and round and they can't sleep. Because they study doing that mental magic and it's going back on their dome. They don't got no sexually, sex, they want some sexual healing from you, Virgo. Okay. You could be who they doing this to or air sign. They selfish spirits say, and they got another. Okay, so the Virgo is the karmic male or female that they working with. They're the selfish partner. So the Virgo just know about it. They could be helping them with the mental, okay? And they could be helping them put it on your crown, okay? Making you want to reach out to them and so forth. It's males involved in here, and it's transgender women. It's side dudes that love you, divine masculine or divine feminine. It's this whole coven. You need to set healthy boundaries with these people, divine masculine. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm so over this whole thing. 
it's these covens they all working together they all sleeping together and they all mad because you could be uh trying to go back to your divine feminine and they want you to stay confused so this air sign uh this air sign so this fire sign is working on this air sign. She could be doing confusion magic. See, each coven have certain they they have certain things they do. She do affirmations. He or she. A first name, middle initial, middle initial, last name, and they all in these coats. So it's like one person is working on confusing you the other person is doing it on your business the other person got another karmic dude a woman they working with okay they all going to jail though they trying to they trying to wish jail on you divine masculine they're working with a narcissist female could be this fire sign okay this scorpio is a side dude who you probably know you think is the friend but they doing magic on you to go to jail okay the truth hurts but that's just what it is spirits say you can have an anaconda or your your they like your woman your divine feminine body because they say you can tell he could tell i ain't missing no meals okay so they could be looking at your divine feminine body and you know this virgo okay you working with them you playing mind games too okay you working with the mental too you selfish person too you is a karmic male or female okay you know what's going on you you want this person to think of you all the time too so it's like a group of these people doing all different type of weird pisces just want sex they don't love nobody all these people are narcs. Y'all need to go love yourself and do something besides worrying about what the next person doing. Alright. And they tell my ooh boy they love you. They only they think they love you because they did all them love spells and that shit going back on this dome. And now they all stuck on you, divine masculine. And you're in the middle just looking goofy. Worrying about the divine feminine. Meanwhile, these people is working all on your dome. And you're getting sick. And they all sick in the head. Yeah, this side dude or chick or whatever is mentally sick. You guys need to grow up. Seriously. Ah. <sighs> So it's like an air sign is in the middle and all these four people, these four women or men is teaming up on one person trying to work on their mental. One is doing business, two people doing mental, trying to get them to call them and reach out. The other person working on this person, uh, Scorpio trying to get this person to go to jail and the other person is working on affirmations or on their business or some another. And they all a hot ass mess. It's just, yep, I said it, and I don't care. 331 as I say that. Y'all all going to jail. And, 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 and Divine Masculine, you better be returning this shit back to center. They all love you. The whole coven love you because they all did love spells, and the shit is backfiring. And they sleep secretly all working together. And it could be a Libra involved, too. Could be working on the divine masculine. Yeah. Or the divine masculine is a Libra and they all trying to work on the divine feminine and ain't none of that shit working. Or these four people, Pisces, Virgo, Virgo Scorpio, Fire, is working on this one Libra here. I say a Libra, so it must be a Libra. In the middle, divine masculine, and they all working on parts of you, divine masculine. Meanwhile, you're just sitting there, just daydreaming and being stuck. And you're not waking up to the fact that these people is playing tricks on your mind. So let's just see what's going on with this whole cult. You need to get out of this old crazy coat. All these people are sick and they all demonic. You could be too. I don't know. Let's see. Tell me more, spirit. Knight of Swords. 
They want they they impulsive. They just doing stuff really quickly. Okay. They could want you to message them. We had call me on the board. Yeah, three of cups. They want you to come back around again. We got Saturn, Mercury retrograde. So they may be trying to come back around. They've been played in your mental enough. So here they come. They want you to call them. They swiftly trying to come around. You could have ended it with all these hoes or men. Take your pick. Okay, and they don't like it. And they all been doing magic on you, Divine Masculine. Nine of Swords also talks about arguing. So you could be fighting with all these lovers here. And you put you want to put it to an end. Yeah, you to move forward. Some of you, you want to travel back to your Divine Feminine. And they know this. So they're working as a group to stop you. Yeah, conflict. I said you could be fighting with these people. So they playing with your mental. Playing mind games. That's the truth, Spirit say. Okay, you want to speak your truth. What I say? The devil. Somebody going to jail. Okay. Now, the Empress could have released this devil, which could have been you, Divine Masculine, because you had all these people playing magic and playing games. What's the devil, Spirit? King of Pentacles. Yeah. A marriage. Some type of toxicity. Seven of Swords. I feel like with the devil and the empress. You could now. You could be obsessing Divine Masculine. You want to be loyal to your Divine Feminine. You don't want to lie to this person. Your empress here. But you're struggling with it because you got people playing in your top. Yeah. You're a little insecure about it. Nine of Wands. And the Empress could be defensive as well. Because of the devil. Because of this black magic and everything that's been going on. Ace of Pentacles. Okay, you want to start something new, but like I said, because of these coats, hair font, you know it's a spiritual connection, but your marriage was revealed. You were married. Some of y'all, this is a coat. Some of y'all, it just was revealed about a baby mama. That's toxic. And your person is still sitting there while they play with your top. <laughs> I just get played with your top. It seems like they just playing with your top all day long. These people is crazy. Yeah. Can't make it up. These lovers. These ex-lovers. It was revealed about these ex-lovers in this group, this cult. Okay. Okay. Trying to hurt you for money, Empress. And now they struggling. And your divine masculine is struggling because he don't want to lie to you no more. He want to be loyal. However, he know he's been playing in that magic. With these people here. He want to tell you the truth, but he mentally conflicted about moving on. Because these people is keep playing with the devil. Send an evil eye. Watching you, Empress. Trying to do magic on everything of yours. Okay, so he waiting patiently right now. I don't know what they waiting on, but whatever. This Queen of Swords. Okay, so the air sign could be the Queen of Swords. She trying to wait and think she going to get some wishes. But Queen of Swords, you ain't getting nothing but a tower. All of y'all. What else, spirit? Somebody did speak their truth. I would have to say that with the Ace of Swords out here. They spoke their truth and they ended the situation with all these lovers, these toxic baby moms. Empress also could talk about a toxic pregnant person that got a son. You could be married with a son with this toxic empress. She's not an empress. She only empress because she's pregnant. 
So she finally got pregnant by the devil. Remember, I had that before. Yeah. Could be with another third party masculine, a Scorpio or Virgo. And she being defensive about it. She trying to defend her marriage. Okay. Because she don't want this person to go. Because she want money. Because she broke. Five of Pentacles. She struggle faced. And I ain't talking about people who struggle. Seven of Swords. The truth is out. Everybody knows she lying. She trying to act like she ain't lying. But she is. We got the Ace of Swords on the board. Okay. Queen of Swords. So yeah, the truth came out. Ain't nothing to cut that bitch off. Yeah, because of the High Priestess. Exactly. Also, this Queen of Swords, this could be you, Divine Feminine. You're in that energy because you know what's going on. Okay, you got your clarity. You already know. You already know what's the tea. And these people trying to fight you with the devil. But the devil worked for you. So, yeah. Truth came out about these third parties trying to collab together. Yeah, they ain't protected. They ain't got no defense. It's backfiring on their skull. And they, they, they in illusions, confusions. They don't know which way to go. They regret that shit. Now, damn, that sucks place. Yeah, I bet. I bet it sucks. Because you didn't let go, ex-lovers. Ace of Wands. Because you just want to sex. Y'all sex addicts because you got entities strapped on your back. Some of y'all could have diseases. We've been getting that a lot. Virgo out here, that pussy hot. And not even trying to be funny. That's just the truth. Hangman. Okay. You guys is waiting to have some type of sex. Divine Masculine could be very passionate about you. Spirits say you just got a lot of options, guys. Y'all sex addicts, y'all need to go get y'all some help. Ooh, you see what's coming out, right? Yeah. So, yeah, Spirit is saying in these options that you're having sex with Divine Masculine, it ain't gonna lead you nowhere but stuck. That's what's keeping you stuck. That devil energy, you two uh, lovers, y'all stuck though. You, the devil got y'all stuck. The devil playing. I told you, devil is a lie. It's a false god, and y'all over there believing him. But that's y'all justice. Spirit said you're going to jail too, by the way. And what goes around comes around, and that's the justice for playing with people' destiny. It's going to be balanced out. Queen of Swords. That's the truth. Because the Queen of Swords talks about the supporter of the truth. Yeah, now you're weary because you cut off from your destiny, Divine Masculine. And you may be going to jail, possibly even death. Because of these lovers you collaborated with. Or these lovers is. Ace of Pentacles. Yeah. Could be getting sick. Yeah. You're in love. You need to go towards your new beginning. And speak your truth. Spirit is saying. Okay. You know you don't love these hoes. Or these dudes. Okay. Or these fuck boys of course. And you're just sitting there. So, I don't know what else to say on this. Yeah, spirits say go heal. Rest yourself. Go heal. Now, Divine Masculine, you could have cut these people off. But spirits say they all shady. They all a fool for lying. And all y'all need to go heal because you probably got something. Spirit is saying leave this all behind, Divine Masculine. Be single. You don't need these people. 
Yeah, go to the one you truly love. Also, these lovers, you guys are fools. But Spirit is saying, go to your, your lover's connection, guys. Go heal. And also, these, these chicks or demonic cults is could be still lying because with the seven of swords upright they could be still lying what's the seven of swords what they lying about the empress yeah they could be lying saying they the empress or the empress doing this and that she could be lying and saying she pregnant of course she ain't got no baby it ain't, it's she pregnant but it ain't your baby divine masculine they keeping you mentally stuck because again they each playing with your magics, one playing on your business, one playing on your mental, keeping you stuck, one playing on trying to make you go to jail. The other one is is doing what they what the Aries doing, working on affirm on affirmations. I believe I forgot. Yeah, making you reject the empress. They working on your mental, man. That's the truth. Can't make this shit up, guys. That's the truth. You got to cut through that mental cloudiness, Divine Masculine. You just sitting there stuck. Yeah, take action, Spirit is saying. You having sex with these old cursed pussy hoes, and they keep it, they're going to keep you stuck. They're going to keep... You stuck, that's what they want to do. You guys got to break out of it. You got to fight those spells and those illusions. That's not you thinking. That's these people. If you think in your head and somebody responds to you in your head, that is not you. That is not spirit. Thank you. You see how I lit up? That is not spirit, and that is not your divine feminine, divine masculine. These are your lovers here. They got you sitting there waiting because you think it's your divine masculine. Talk, I mean, yeah, the divine masculine, you're waiting. You think it's your divine feminine talking to you in your skull, and it ain't. It's these ex-lovers. Divine feminine ain't talking to you. And it's keeping you nostalgia. 27, 27, you, you waiting on the divine feminine to reach out because you think in your skull she talking to you and she's not. And if it's my masculine, I ain't said nothing to you. It's them lovers. Yeah, you're going to miss an opportunity. They want you to miss an opportunity to divine masculine. You got to wake up. They are all working together. The Pisces, Virgo, Scorpio, Libra, and Aquarius, and Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Your family and your friends and your lover. And the one that says she pregnant and ain't pregnant by you. Five of Swords. They winning at all costs. But don't worry. Because it's going to be balanced out. You see that? They want to keep you juggling back and forth, Divine Masculine. Seven of Wands. Okay. You got to let go of that juggling aspect. Get you some help if you need to ask for help. You got a whole happy connection that you can go to. But you just study sitting there thinking you're talking to your Divine Feminine. Your Divine Feminine is over here winning. Queen of Cups, because she's following her intuition. She's healing. And you're in your ego, and you're not healing. You're thinking you're, you're doing something, and you're not. Go to your joyous connection. Okay? Last final word, Spirit, because I'm, I'm getting up out of here. Six of Pentacles. This Queen of Cups here, this could be another one that's playing with your psyche. This person ain't balanced. Okay. Six of Pentacles in reverse. What's the Six of Pentacles in reverse? Spirit? Knight of Cups. So she could be trying to return back to you, Divine Masculine, acting like she is healed. Okay. You could be trying to go back to your soulmate, but Spirit is saying you're not balanced enough. Yeah, the Emperor, okay. 
That's what I was thinking. So, Emperor, you're trying to go back. Now, I could read these two ways. Emperor, you are trying to go back to your divine feminine, but you're not balanced. Okay? You're just trying to be in control here. With the Knight of Cups, That's the Knight is not actually grown up. Knight is like they still playing around. You just want to take control of the situation because you know your divine feminine ain't giving you no type of equal give and take right now. And you wanting some love and care. Yet you want to still play these with these lovers here. So spirit is saying that ain't happening. You got to heal. Spirit calling judgment. You under judgment for that. And so until you heal and get yourself together, yeah, ten of swords, and put this shit to an end, and you betrayed your divine feminine with these damn lovers. You broke a heart, so you're in the judgment for that, which means you ain't getting no money either, because six of pentacles talk about you could be still trying to give to these lovers, and spirit is saying, hold back from these lovers and go heal. And get out of that nine of wands energy. Acting first and thinking later. And go heal divine masculine. You could just be wanting to come back for sex. Or I don't know. However. But you're going to get a tower. Tower. That foundation you want to hold on to so bad. That house is going down. It's cracking. Because you got secrets. Divine masculine. You don't want your, your feminine to know. Well, Spirit is saying, it's coming out. What's this moon and tower? King of Pentacles. Yeah, that, that marriage you in, it's cracking. This person is doing moon magic on you. And you could have did moon magic on the Empress. That's why you're in the judgment. What's the moon? You, you was hiding the fact that you were married. Yeah, nine of Pentacles. And you were trying to act independent. So Spirit is saying you're getting a tower for that. Some of you, these are these single women out here, or men, okay? They are doing moon magic for just for money, because you give them money. And Spirit is saying, move on. It's better things ahead, guys. Don't stay with these people. They about to be in a page of pentacles, okay? So the tower could be divine masculine. You, you're not going to have no money. You study sitting there, so you're going to get a tower. Spirit is going to call. Yeah, you're going to be stressed out. You could be stressed out now because you ain't got no money. You're in mental conflict. You need to go heal and get balanced out. And lovers, y'all already know where y'all going. Should I have to keep saying it? Should I have to keep saying it? Just wait on that. Yeah. This way you're going to be looking. This way you're going. Damn, that sucks. That place sucks, place. For giving people all this flu flux. It's over, Carmita Carmichael's. Let it go. Yes. Call judgment. Walk away. It's over. Y'all could be in the mental prison already, actually. Just a mental prison in your mind if y'all not going to jail. Alright, so I'm going to leave it here. I guess same message is kind of just coming out, guys. It's because people not listening. And Spirit is so trying to tell y'all because I'm telling you, it's not going to be nice, guys. It's not. And these people, look at here. One, 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 as I said that. Look, it just turned two. In that shit, Divine Masculine. It's going to end either way. See, Spirit trying to be nice. It's like, do you want us to be rough? Or do you want us to be hard? Uh, you know, you're blocked. You're blocked from coming, Divine Masculine, until you get yourself together. You've been working with that third party to block. In third party, y'all been working to block the connection. Okay. All right. Free yourself, Divine Masculine. Stop sitting there looking like put yourself first. Spirit is saying, you're not putting yourself first. 
Go through that transformation and stop worrying about other people, what people going to say. You're sitting over there looking sad anyway. They're talking about you anyway. Okay? You did something in the spring and the summertime. You're sad all summer, spring. You know who you got romantic feelings for. Go on and do what you got to do so you can get good karma. Could be W. So you can get that win. You're just sitting there. You ain't winning as long as you're sitting there with these Carmita Carmichaels. I'm going to tell y'all that now. you just going to be tied to their karma. If you're having sex with them, this, this is what you're doing every night. Every night. Look at this. Look at this. No money. In mental prison. This is what these karmics is right now to this day. And Divine Masculine, as long as you sit over there, this is what you're going to be in. The Eight of Swords, Nine of Pentacles in the reverse, and, and Nine of Swords. All because you're just sitting there and you won't heal. Spirit is trying to help you. You're looking at the cup. And you ain't taking it. You'd rather just sit here with these people that's in this energy. Fighting demons all night. Call judgment on that shit and go. Some of y'all can't go because you're under judgment. And you know what you need to do. You know you need to walk away, Divine Masculine. Stop being scared. You're only scared because you're not healing. You know, all of us were scared at one point in time because you're just scared of the unknown. But once you start healing, you start getting that good karma. You'll realize, oh, it's nothing really to be fearful of. Yeah, you get a money increase and everything. Scorpio, you still social media and stalking people. You need to let it go. But as long as y'all sit there, hey, what can you do? What can you do? You can only say what you can say. You know, I hope people get these messages. And if you're not, hey, that's on y'all. That's what y'all choosing to do, man. And until further notice... You just like to get towers on y'all skull. Ain't much, ain't, ain't much else people can say. Just go heal. Y'all making stuff harder for yourself. All right, so I'm going to end it here. Once again, what goes around comes around. Deja vu, Tarot. Peace. <laughs>